Okay. Hello, grade fives, and welcome to a virtual class. I know you've stayed home for quite some time now due to this Kasmohani Mokoti COVID-19, which has brought the world to a standstill. Nevertheless, we'll be learning from home using uh, internet and uh, uh, using technology. Uh, this is a virtual classroom, all right. Uh, I know you have even forgotten some of the things that we learned before we closed. Most of you maybe are just busy watching TV, but it's time to be going through what you learned in term one, okay? Right, um, today we are going to look at a new topic, the first topic for term two, and this is called graphics, okay? Computer graphics, right? Now, what is, what are computer graphics, all right? That is what we are going to look at. And is specifically we are going to look at computer graphics as a package, all right? As a package, right? Now, a graphic package is used to create pictures or to make changes to a picture, all right? Now, these packages, when we talk about graphics, packages we are talking about software that is created to edit pictures to draw pictures to paint pictures all right are we together or images so we are talking about software that is made to edit draw and just manipulate the pictures which is called computer graphic package all right now the most common package that we know okay the most common package that we know for graphics that is found on the computer is paint okay that is the most common uh, graphics or a package that we use in graphics is called paint this paint comes already embedded or already installed on the computer okay a computer that uses windows all right a computer that windows uses windows as an operating system all right it always they come with the paint if you look at windows 10 okay windows 10 has come with the 3D paint, all right? 3D paint, okay? This paint is a program, if you remember, that we did or we are using a lot in grade four. In grade four, we learned about paint. We looked at the tools that are found in paint, okay? And this paint qualifies to be called a graphic, a graphic, package okay package because it is it is able to you are able to manipulate a, a drawing or a picture all right if you remember those of you can remember when we were using paint last year i showed you how to edit we edited a penguin and removed its head and put the head of the dog you remember yes and without you cannot even see where the head of the dog was joined to the neck of the penguin because of the tools that are found in this graphic package All right okay let's proceed All right now there are so many types of graphic packages, all right? The first one, as I've said, we have paint, is the common graphic package that we have. Then we have Photoshop, okay? Photoshop is a graphic package used by professional graphic artists and photographers to create and edit pictures, all right? So if you know any photographer or you have 
you know any cameraman who is professional, ask them, they will tell you that most of the times they use Photoshop to edit pictures. Or when you go to studios, all right, where they take pictures and develop even pictures, you'll find that most of them they use Photoshop to edit pictures. Then we have also Corel Draw, used by professional graphic artists and photographers to create and edit pictures. Though this one has advanced features or options compared to Photoshop and Paint. Okay, it's a bit advanced. All right, and for you to use this, you need to practice a lot and learn how Corel Draw is. It is a very nice package that you, you can use. All right. There are also other advanced graphic pa packages used by architects. Okay. Architects are engineers, all right, who draw plans for houses and other buildings. All right. Before a house, okay, before a house is built, before a house is built, Architects or engineers, they come up with a drawing or a plan for that house, all right? And that plan will be given to the builders now, all right? The builders will get that plan and start interpreting it on the ground and they start what? Building, all right? So if you just wake up today to say, I will build a, a house, you need to see an architect or an uh, engineer to draw a plan for you, all right? And that plan, for them to come up with that plan, they use graphic packages to draw those plans, all right? So if you have a dad or mom who is an engineer or an architect, ask them to show you the graphic package they use to draw the plan okay all right we have also designers all right designers design products from electrical from electrical equipment to lay out of books magazines articles and other print materials all these they use specific graphic packages that allow them to design these things all right Designers, for example, those who design layouts of books, magazines, articles, and other print materials, like here in Zambia, most of them they use Corel Draw. Okay, they use Corel Draw. Okay, all right. We have also other engineers who design structures such as bridges and dams. Okay, dam walls. All these they use the uh, graphic packages. If you are able to see in the picture that I've put here, you will see that uh, the architect or an engineer is drawing the plan of the house here, okay? Then we have another one here coming up with uh, the design or plan of the car. You see, these cars that we see, before they become real cars, all right, an engineer sits somewhere, they start drawing the shape of the car using certain advanced graphic packages that the, they use on the computers to come up with the shape and colors and how the vehicle will be looking like, okay? The vehicle will look in this way, it will have that color, the tires or the rims will look like that. That is drawn first using graphic packages, right? Here you can see uh, this lady is designing or drawing a flower on the computer she is using a graphic package okay she's using a graphic package okay now so in short we are saying we have seen to say graphic packages are packages that enables us to come up with a drawing or to edit a drawing or a picture or a, a photograph 
whatever okay the source does not matter these uh, graphs or maybe pictures for example photographs you can download them from the internet you can capture them using your camera or your phone okay all those can be edited using a graphic package all right now I wanted us to use paint to design just something that we needed if we were in school. But if you have a computer at home, okay? If you have a computer at home, please try to use the graphic package that we all know that we learned last year. And this is the paint, okay? This is paint. And you are going to come up with a plan, all right? A house plan of a three bedroom D house. Are we together? Just come with it, come up with a plan of a three bedroom house. Okay, I'll send this work from the further instructions. You can download it as you are downloading the, uh, where you downloaded the video. For now, we'll end here. Uh, we'll meet in the next lesson as we go ahead. Hello, bye-bye, see you. Thank you.